Okay. Trying to return Natalie's draw paw. Okay. This isn't door. It's just a drawing of a door on a wall. Okay. Is this like part of the cave area? Some sort of rock tower thing. It's catwalk. Also looks very unsafe. Nah, it's fu- Oh, that's where I came from. What? I'm going backwards, apparently. Whoops. Yeah, I came from there. A trash can. Can I have the paper? Someone threw a poem in the trash can. Orange soda. Lukewarm and runny. Whenever I drink it, my stomach feels funny. <laughs> I like that one. A water cooler. Looks like it's full of orange so No! <laughs> a clock with no hands. Oh god, is that a spider web? Do spiders go to purgatory? Eleven tal- Wait. No. That wouldn't work. Pencil. The lead is broken. Isn't this the cat from the other room? I don't think I want to be over here just yet. A crack. Guess the afterlife's not all that's cracked at the beginning. <laughs> okay. Wait. 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 Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I never went that way. What do you mean? Lies. It's all lies. Hey, dude, what's up? Hey, you doing okay? Oh, I'm fine, don't worry. If you ever want to talk about what happened at the museum or anything... Hey, listen, dude. It's no bigs. Not even like a mediums? Not even a medium fries and coke, dude. I'm a troublemaker. Always been. Breaking sculptures, breaking hearts. It's just another day in the life of Sean the Snake, baby. Yeah, you mean death? Hmm. Just another day in the death of Sean the Snake, baby. Doesn't have the same ring to it. Maybe not. What's up with the piano? You tell me, dude. It's all meows and shit. Hmm. Must be a Yamaha. God damn it. As a band kid, I get that one. Most of the instrument brands are Yamaha. Showing roads. Ugh. Hate to admit it, but that one was good. Thanks. Can you play me something? Hell yeah. Listen to this. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Good for you. That was nice. Thank you, thank you. Please, no autographs right now. Do you know anything else? Yeah, also no chopsticks and twinkle twinkle little star. Wow. It's hard to my instrument, man. I'm no good at piano. By the way, do you play at all? Maybe we can have a little jam sesh. Uh, I could try. Let's jam. All right. Let me just get a little warmed up. Okay, what is happening? I mean... Damn it. Wait, what happened? I think it is out of battery. No! Oh! I know, this blows. We need two AA batteries. Otherwise, we are prohibited from jamming. Banned from the jam. Exactly. Let's see if I can find some. Please do. I don't know how much longer I can go without jamming. Uh, I was hoping that I could take the batteries from that and maybe just... Oh, wait. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, it's stuck on ca- I can't change it? Boo! Um. I don't even know. Use the ladder. Dang, I can't use the ladder on it? Only can't. I- It- No. I already checked the locker. 
Ooh, I know who might have batteries. Well, I can talk to you again. Oh, hey. Uh, how's the gardening? Oh, the flowers are doing well. It's some tough caring for flowers that don't exist anywhere on a mortal plane. But, you know, I'm making do. Watch shade bubbles, experimenting with mulching, um, you know, that sort of stuff. Sounds awesome. <laughs> um, yeah. Were you a gardener in real life? Do? Well, I had a backyard garden. I like to think I was pretty good at it, but, um, as a job, I was an intern at an accounting firm. Oh, I see. Did you like accounting? Oh, yeah. I mean, aren't all the cool kids into accounting? <laughs> What do accountants do anyways? Well, in a broad sense, they're in charge of keeping financial records. I worked in a public accounting firm, which means business would come to us to prepare their financial statements and advise them on future transactions. It's really important work. Oh, uh, I was just an intern though, so mostly I did data entry. Cool. Does that mean you could do my taxes? Uh, no, uh, that's a different type of accounting. Sorry. Oh, okay. Hmm. Where's that moth? Wait, I never did come over here. I didn't come over here! A leaf. Why would anyone leaf this? Oh my god. Oh. Oh! I'm finding things! Why would anyone stick this at the- God dang it! More leaves. I can't be leaf. You're not out of punch. <laughs> oh my god. I, I love puns, but this might actually be too much for me. Whoa, okay. Lots and lots of tally marks. It says Numa's diary on the front. Nah. I'm not gonna be that. I'm not evil. I'm not gonna read her diary. Drawing of a familiar looking hyena. Pillow is stuffed with leaves. It's personal. I'm just gonna ignore it. I clicked off the. Uh. Black Star? Stop short as you run into Numa in the vents. What are you doing in here? I was just exploring. Just exploring? In someone else's room? No, I I'm sorry, I didn't know. I can't believe this. You think screwing shut a door would be enough to keep people out? You didn't read my notebook, did you? No. Of course not. Okay, okay good. Because you shouldn't have. I'm sorry for asking, but... Are you counting the days you've been here? Yeah, I guess. How come? I don't know. I just have to keep track. Otherwise, time just blends together, and I hate it. I see. Is that a drawing of Kunsun? No? I mean, uh... Maybe? It's not your business. I'm sorry, sorry. Just, I didn't think you two would be friends, I guess. W well, we're not. Girlfriends then? No! I mean, not that there would be anything wrong with that. I mean... Numa covers her face. Ah! Uh, ah, uh, I get it. <laughs> <laughs> she has an identical twin. Ah, uh -huh. no, you have a crush on her. Okay, yes! I have a crush on Kyunsoon! I knew it. It's just that I can never work up the courage to talk to her, even though I've been stuck here for years. I never thought, told anyone about it either, because I'm just afraid she'll find out. It's not like I can give her our flowers because they all smell horrible. Ugh, I just don't know what to do. Numa puts her hand on her head. What am I telling this to you, of all people? It's okay, it's okay. I know how it feels. I, mean, I could talk to her for you, and... Don't you dare! I mean... Numa takes another deep breath. I mean, please don't do that. Jeez, okay. Sorry, it's just... If I'm gonna tell her, I have to do it myself. I see. But why Kunsun? What do you mean? She's so tall and mysterious. And smart, and pretty, and fluffy. Huh? Would you please back up for the wiki gals, man? Oh, right. Sorry, sorry. Numa crawls back, and you crawl out of the vent. Please don't tell anyone about this. Hmm? Chat? 
Bear promise. Can I have the screwdriver, please? Here. Numa takes the screwdriver and hurries down the stairs. I'll go back. Hey, um, hello. Really sorry about snooping around earlier. It's fine. Sorry for blowing up at you. It's okay. I probably deserved it. Uh, let me know if there's anything I can do to make up for it. Sure. Do you stand around awkwardly? The Numa goes back to watering. Oh, wait. Maybe I need to go, like, wait. I thought... I don't know why. I thought batteries would be in there. What if I had to go, like, all the way back? Hey, you have batteries? Uh, oh, hi, Black Star. Hey, Oliver. I'm really sorry about earlier with the book. I should have realized that. No, no, no it, it's alright. I overreacted. It's just one book, after all. As much as it rubs me the wrong way to see a book treated like that, I can't fault you for what you did. Still, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to upset you. Hey, it's alright. If anything, Kyun Soon is the one at fault here. <laughs> maybe. She seemed to touch on some, uh... Touchy subjects during that argument. Well, it's nothing serious. Kun Soon just knows that m mentioning my earthly regrets is an easy way to push my buttons. When she talks, you think I murdered someone. Did you? Oh, what? No, of course not. If you did, I wouldn't judge. Just saying. Now, that's very kind of you, but the point is moot. It's because I didn't. Well, if you didn't murder anyone, then why are your what are your earthly regrets? Um, maybe we can discuss this some other time? Ah, okay. Sorry, I didn't mean to pry. It, it, it's fine. Hi again. What's up? Well, I don't know. Who does? True, though. Still is jammed? Can I whack it with a ladder? Nope. I will find a use for this ladder at some point. Just you wait. Kyunsun? Uh, what's up? What's up? It's purgatory. Nothing's ever up. Fair? Fine. Wait, 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 wait. Can... Aww. You see, I'm being stupid right now. Uh, what about the bell? Should I leave it alone still? Okay, fine. Jeez, I'll leave it alone. 21. Hang on a second. Well. I tried. Now, where was the ma? Not here. Uh. So that doesn't work. Okay. Moho's up here. Maybe you have batteries? No response. Dang it! Maybe the disappointing elevator. Nope. Hmm. I mean, they're... Hmm. Hmm. It's not gonna leave. Can I... You have batteries. I'm sure you do. Oh, hi. You need help with that? Nah, no, I'm doing alright. Just me and the word spaghetti bouncing around my head. Uh, what's up? Nothing. Yep, sounds about right. Uh, you sure you don't need help? I feel bad leaving you here to clean up. I'm good, man. I'm good. Wasn't getting anywhere with poetry anyways, so maybe a break would be good for me. Ah, makes sense. Besides, you just got here. You shouldn't be doing chores. Go and introduce yourself to everyone else, man. True, I guess I should do that. I know about Schrodinger's cat. 
Uh, you write a lot of poetry, huh? <laughs> you could say that. I already... I guess, can I hear some of it? Let me think. This one's called Stuff You Can Find in Purgatory. Books, nooks, white walls, long falls, kyunsun, chicken scratch, a garden with a cat in it patch. I like that one. I thank you. Can I take the plane? Nope, I can't take the plane. Some luck. Hmm. Nope. Oh, wait. I I'm an idiot. I am learning. Because I have not explored much else here. I'm not even going to question what in the world that is, but sure. We'll live with that then. Table with seven circular indentations in it. Caution. It's emergency lights. Can I... I can go up it! Excuse me? How? I don't like that. A garden gnome. You feel like this is a reference to something, but you're only half sure. It's cat food. A crowbar? Can I have it? Just a plank or something. Lots of big containers. Um, more big containers. A pallet. Some sort of cube. Because, you know, we don't know what boxes are. That says, notice, authorized workers only in the warehouse, please. The smaller text says, beware of hazardous materials and heavy machinery. Purgatory claims no liability in case of death or dismemberment. Oh. Looks like a train schedule. Under departure, it says, Heaven Delayed. Under arrival, it says, Black Star Arrived. That's you! It's me! <laughs> Uncomfortable looking bench. A vending machine. Black Star? I've been expecting you. Huh? How do you know my name? Simple. It says right there on the screen. Look at the arrival screen where your name's listed. Oh, weird. Yes, your name has been there for over a week. But as usual... No one seems to notice but me. To be fair, I was expecting you to show up in a train. Anyways, my name's Tori. Entrepreneur, black belt, and deceased soul. If you don't mind, I have some questions for you. Tori lifts a clipboard. Uh, okay, I guess. One, who are you? And what's your purpose here? Tell, I, I guess I'll tell the truth. I woke up in an office with an old lady who said I was going to purgatory. And when I went through a portal, I ended up here. Hmm, that checks out. Two, what would you say was your greatest sin? Uh, I don't really remember. Really? Yeah, I woke up without any memories at all. Sorry. Hmm, I suppose people have reported memory loss before. Tori flips through her clipboard. Well, that answers most of the rest of my questions. Ugh. One last question. What do you think that means? She pointed at the departure screen, which says, Heaven Delayed. It's a joke. Like most of the signs in here. Well, that's certainly an astute observation. Regardless, I'm not interested in standing around and waiting for some celestial beating being to have mercy on me. I'm trying to break out of here, and I think that sign means I'm close. Can I count on you to help, newbie? Sure. That's the spirit. Now, if you'll excuse me, I got some work to attend to. I think it's time to dig up some clues. Stay frosty, Blackstar. See ya. Tori briskly walks away. Unfortunately, the tunnel ends like ten feet. So much for finding Natalie. Um, stained glass window. Let's go in the door. Live, laugh, meow. Someone really went to town on these pillows. Cool plant. Oh, that's where I came from. Okay. Oh, a snow globe. I'll take it. Instead of a mattress, this bed just has a cat bed on top of it. Oh, I can go in the attic. <gasps> Wait, I'm in your place? 
There's a lighter and some dust bunnies in a drawer. Candles. It's the Mona Lisa with a cat face. A, a moth. A drawing of an old lady. A UFO. Doggo! A rainbow. What a cute dog. A drawing of a galaxy. There's nothing behind this one. It was just mounted on a wall. Some art supplies. More candles. A box. Who's in that crate? Hello? What? Oh, hey. Who are you? I'm new here. Hi, new here. I'm Natalie. Oh, you're Natalie? Really? Nice one. Thanks. I'll be here all eternity. But really, what's your name? I it's Blackstar. Cool, nice to meet you. Uh, I'm guessing you don't remember the cookies thing? What cookies thing? Well, there they are. rang the doorbell and you showed up and said you didn't want any cookies and then left. I, th I did? Oh my god, I must have been sleepwalking. I'm sorry. I was just having a great dream about cookies. <laughs> it's okay. It was funny. Still, sheesh. What a way to make a first impression. It's all good, really. I like cookies, too. So how long you've been here? Oh, it's been a while. Still have the books I checked out from Oliver when I arrived. Ooh. Probably overdue by years. Oh, yeah. He convinced me to borrow a book, too. You, too? <laughs> that boy never changes. I really should return those books, come to think of it. Want me to take them for you? Probably heading down there anyways. Oh, heck, that would be awesome. Thanks. I'm glad I'm not alone in this endeavor. God. Don't worry, I'll make sure to book it to the library. I'm sure Oliver will be elated to have them back. Our library is good at circulation. I think they covered that in a newspaper. Newspaper? More like newspaper. Okay, that one sucked. They can't all be winners. Here's the books, anyway. Tell Oliver I thought they were good. Weren't you using them to hold up a table? Well, maybe. But he doesn't need to know that. Can I talk to you? What's up? I just had a dream that Purgatory was full of snakes and it's called Snurgatory. <laughs> I don't even know what to, I don't even know what to say about that. <laughs> uh, here's your draw, Pa. Huh? Is this yours? No way! You found my draw, Pa? Thank you so much, dude. You're a real pal. You're welcome. If I can ever return a favor, just let me know. The least I can do is lend a Pa. Snurgatory. Thanks. I'll let you know for sure. Aww. How's the drawing? It's going great. I haven't drawn anything in, like, ages. I'm drawing a little robot dude right now. Cool. Can I see? Uh, I'll show you when I'm done. It's not really worth looking at right now. Oh, okay. So yeah, check back. <laughs> Later or something. Oh, jeez, I'm getting tired. <laughs> What's about life? I liked it. Eight out of the ten. What'd you do for a living? Janitor, Denver Museum of Nature and Science. How's that? Well, I worked overnight so I didn't have to talk to anyone. And I got into planetarium shows for free. So, can't complain. That didn't stop my mom from nagging me that it's not a real job. Oh, that sucks. Eh, what can you do? Any other questions? About... Um... Any regrets? Just one, dude. Not finishing my webcomic while I was alive. Ooh, a webcomic? Yeah, I wasn't even halfway through. Oh well. Not like I could have known when I would die. I'm sorry. What was it about? Oh, it's about like a moth that fights nightmares in a dreaming world. It's pretty awesome. Sounds like a dream come true. You heckin' know it. Uh, about the books. Okay, yeah. So which was your name again? <laughs> okay. Fine, I'll go return the books. The sofa. Oh, that's where I came from. Oh, so now I can just enter the door. Better. 
What do you need better? Oh, it's a double A battery. Cool. I was wait, I was right. She did have batteries. A bar of soap, a rag, fancy vase. Better return the book. I think I'll keep the books. I'll give them to Coon Scoon. Looks like someone's pushing glasses off this counter. Glass dangerously close to the edge. A sink. Yep, it's, it dispenses milk. Can't open it because someone forgot to draw handles on it. Oh! How dare they? Wasn't there more? Like an upstairs? Yeah. It's that freaking cat again! Won't budge and no keyhole. Oh. Fine, let me out. I'll go freaking return the books then. Who knows, maybe Oliver will have something. Oh, hi! Ah, Blackstar, just the person I wanted to see. Oh, wow. Are you trying to dig out a purgatory? What do you think I'm doing? Digging a lat latrin? But is going further down really going to help us? Yeah, it's worth a shot. You know what they say? What goes down must come up. But I don't think they say that. Nonsense. Want to grab a shovel? I, uh, sure, I'll, I dig it. Hilarious. Get your shovel. Knock yourself out. Let me know if you dig up anything weird. That was easy enough. Explore the park. Oh my god, words again. Explore the park and click on hot spots. The ground to dig. Oh. You found a cat themed clock. That is cr 16. Oh no. You oh. found. Ooh, a coin. Buried coins? That doesn't even make sense. Found a cat themed chess piece. Starting to get a little bored. Need a break? Oh, oh no, it was just a pun. Oh, Should have figured. You found. Hey, a snow globe! That's five! I don't know how many of those suckers there are, but. Whoa, I, I think I missed this part of the place. Yeah, I did. Oh, I missed quite a few things. Hang on a minute. Broken down shack. Some more dead trees. Oh, a diamond! Holy shit! What is it? Look, I found a diamond! You think it's real? Hold up to your mouth and breathe on it. The fog goes away immediately. It's real. You breathe on the gem. Oh my god, it's real. Great. What are we going to do with it? Uh... Huh. Good point. Give it to Kyun soon. Maybe she'll eat it. <laughs> I was going to give her books, but you know what? Give her a diamond. A toy robot. Something about this doesn't feel right. A can of beans. I can't believe it. Hey, I love black beans. Is it still good? Let me see. Next to Best Buy, it just says good luck. Huh. My inventory is just going to be full of junk. I found nothing. Boo! How dare there be nothing there? Did I get everything here? I did. Found a foot. Oh, I'm just. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna leave that where I found it. You're not gonna tow it away? Wait, was that a pawn? Oh god, you're rubbing off on me. Shut up! Found a bone. I have a bone to pick with this place. You said it. You got munchies, Dory? Found I found Kyunsun! <laughs> Where? <laughs> Kyunsun? Sup? What are you doing in the ground? I don't know. Just chilling. Kyunsun, wanna help us dig? <laughs> no thanks. I'm gonna go back to the comments. But take care. Found a worm. My cousin! Hey! What do you think that worm did to end up in purgatory? Hmm. Digging under the influence. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry I asked. As you should be. Oh, there's another. I, I found a, a, a shovel. This feels weird for some reason. Um, cousin worm. Yes. I was called worm by a lot of people in high school. 
And not only high school, my last job, I was still given the nickname of Worm. On accident. Found a mini <gasps> I'm starting to get hot, so it's a good thing I got a little cooler. Ha! <laughs> a rock. That doesn't rock. Can I... Oh, there's another one. Found a ukulele. You gotta be kidding me. Did you eat dirt at work? No! I didn't even have anything to do with dirt! It's mainly because I'm tall, and I make weird movements. Just like I did in school. Hey, I used to play the ukulele. Did you know I directed my school's ukulele ensemble? Cool. You want this one? No, thanks. I'm afraid it'll somehow make meow noises. Tori! What the hell are you doing? Oh, oh, just trying to save us all. You're welcome. You're ruining the park! Eh, debatable. Did you miss the part about saving us all? Oh my god, how many holes did you dig? Don't worry, no more than 20. 20?! Uh, I'm sorry. I didn't think about the damage we're doing. Of course you didn't! Numa closes her eyes. Okay, okay, deep breaths, Numa. Uh, listen, I I'm sorry, I'll make it up to you somehow. Leave Blackstar out of it, at least it... It was my idea. Fine, we'll talk about this later. Numa stomps away. Sheesh. My bad, Blackstar. This plan was bust anyways. I guess it wasn't a very wholesome plan. You can say that again. But don't worry, I have a feeling my next plan will be electric. I'll see you around, okay? Okay. Stay sharp. Um, Time to go over... Th I keep clicking off the game. I'm sure you guys can see it when my mouse just goes bloop and then... <laughs> yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Oh. Eat anything good lately? Alright, good talk. Hi again, Blackstar. Hey, Natalie asked me to turn these books to you. Huh? Oh. Well, thank you very much. I'll check these in right away. You're welcome. Goodness, I almost forgot about these. Do you do you think she enjoyed them? Uh, I think she liked them. Oh, oh good, good. She must have really been taking the time with them, huh? <laughs> yeah. You know, there's a surprising amount of nuance if you read between the lines. Oliver riffles through one of Natalie's books and a piece of paper falls out. Whoops, is, is this yours? Uh, no, maybe it's Natalie's. I'll trust you to hold on to it then. Probably just a bookmark or something. Anyways, I better get these back on the shelf for future patrons. Until next time, see ya. So, now I can go give Natalie the... the note. A nice scenic path. Wait a minute. Business card for Lucifer. Senior Soul Accommodation Manager. Hell Inc. PO 666. The Inferno. 555 Lucifer. Prince of Hell at Hotmail.com. Wait, 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 wait. 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 The gears are turning. Anyone else smelling the smoke? L U C I F U R. L U C I F U R. Hello, valued sinner. You've reached the office of the devil. For inquiries about redeeming lost souls, press 1. For ferrying services, press 2. To speak to the devil, press three. With our Hell Haste Soul Redemption Service, you can pay off your mortal sins in no time at all. Please wait while we retrieve the latest information. Bookmark, huh? Yeah, what a great bookmark. We regret to inform you that no souls are being redeemed at this time. Please call again soon. Okay. Wait, clear. I'll keep calling. 
Uh, I guess ferrying services. Thank you for choosing Soul Fair. Our state-of-the-art ferrying services make passing on a comfortable steam line experience. To upgrade your account to premium, press 1. For a schedule of upcoming departures from your location, press 2. Premium members get reduced wait times at designated Soul Fair's office and one free haunting per year, all for a low price of your soul. We detect that your name is Blackstar. Please wait while we retrieve your information. No account could be found under your name. Please call again soon. Dang it, man. Um, what about departures? We detect that you are calling from Purgatory. Please wait while we retrieve the latest information. Unfortunately, Soul Fair service is not currently available at your location. Really? Uh, I would like to speak to Devil. Your finger hovers over the three button. You have a feeling there's no going back after this action. What do you mean? Maybe later. Maybe later. We'll deal with that at a later time then. I have unfinished a business. Quite a bit of it even. Hey, Natalie. Why was this in your book? Oh, I don't even I can't even ask about it. Uh, what about anything you miss? Hmm. Like, out of everything? Tamales. Oh yeah, tamales are good. So good. Used to eat them every time going to Mexico to fin visit family. They were so delicious. Wow, Lucky. It's the little things in life. I, I can't even ask her about the bookmark? That's kind of depressing, actually. Now, I'm in, oh, hey, you okay? Yeah, I, I'm good, I'm good. Why are you on the floor? Well, sometimes it's a standing up kind of day, sometimes it's a laying down kind of day. Today turned out to be more of a laying down kind of day. I see, maybe you could lie down somewhere more comfortable though. Nah, this is good. If you say so. Lying on the floor, what a bore. Makes me want to snore. Makes your back sore? Now you get it, now you get it. Did you ha have a chance to meet the others, by the way? Oh yeah, they're an interesting bunch. How are you getting along? Well... Natalie... You lie down next to Elijah. Natalie's nice. That she is. I still remember when she made everyone the origami bouquets. Totally made my day. That's a nice little gesture. You been up in her attic? Yeah. It's really cozy. Damn. Well, the coziest place in purgatory, if you ask. No, damn well the coziest place in purgatory, if you ask me. Hang out there often? Oh, well, not really. I won't want to bother her or nothing. Seems like I'm nothing but a nuisance nowadays. Oh, I'm sure that's not true. Eh? Sorry. I just haven't been feeling like myself lately. I guess a prolonged stay in purgatory will do that to you. Yeah, I guess so. Anything I, help, I can do to help cheer you up? No, oh, man. Your company is already real well appreciated. Yeah, of course. Just let me know if you want to, I don't know, do something fun. Well, if you can think of something fun to do down here, you can color me impressed. I'll think about it. For now, I will lie here till my brain decides to give me a serotonin or two. Good luck with that. Thanks. Where was the keyboard? Down here. Yo, yo, yo. So, who's Danny? You don't mind me asking, who's Danny? Uh, just my partner. Left him behind when I died. Oh, I'm sorry. What up, man? Moaning about it isn't going to bring him back. Or me back. I don't even know who would hypothetically be brought back in this scenario. Still, that must be really tough. 
Want to tell me more about them? They're alive. I'm dead. Oh, what more you want to know? Fair, I guess. We can do it for fun. I already read it. Uh, let's jam. I found a battery. Great. Just one more and we can jam. Question. Why am I just doing all the searching? Because I am lazy. I see. Right, I forgot that we needed a second battery. What are your hobbies? Oh, you know, sitting, breathing. What about real life? Before you died. Video games, I guess. Cool, what kind? The kind where you mind your own business. Oh, uh, I love those games. Me too. What about the bell? Is there like... I still can't do anything with the bell? Gotta be like still jammed. I'm not reading the books again. Oops. Uh, I misclicked. <laughs> the screen is so small, I just closed the game. One second. What do you mean, boo? Everything's fine. Everything is perfectly fine. I don't th stop throwing tomatoes. Meh. <laughs> I wonder if the cat... Nope, the cat still is a cat. I was gonna say, maybe the cat has batteries. Wait, what's it, a tomato throw party? No! Oh, wait, the clock might have a battery. No. No, stop throwing tomatoes! Wait, what? Oh! Hidden snow globe? Rope? Hey, battery! Stinky, stinky bag of fertilizer, soap, some paper towels, box full of spoons, a bucket. It's, uh, actually, you have no clue what this is. Stop throwing tomatoes! According to this counter, it's Meowvember the 4th. Uh, paper towels, a sink. Ah, Black Star, my favorite sinner. Wear these, you'll need these. Tori hands you a pair of heavy-duty gloves. Huh? What's up now? Electricity makes the world go round. And also purgatory, presumably. I am Tomato Gunner. Fire, heat, tomato... No! <laughs> Stop throwing tomato! <laughs> what did I do to deserve this? No! Stop it! <laughs> These wires have to be hooked up to something, and that something's outside of purgatory. Thus, this box could be our ticket out of here. Think you can help? I guess I'll do my best. Perfect. Take a look. Peer into the electrical box. Now, I'm no amateur when it comes to electrical engineering, but frankly, the circuit is dumbfounding me. Something's supposed to happen when you connect the nodes a certain way? It's hoping you had better luck than me. Are you sure this is safe? Fairly sure. Let's say 90%. I gave you the gloves, didn't I? I guess so. Okay. I just broke everything. I am... Uh-oh. Plexter, what did you do? I, I don't know, I just connected a wire! Ugh, looks like the power's out all over Purgatory. Great, just what we needed. Maybe if I undo what I did, the lights turn back on? You squint, but you can't make out any of the wires in the dark. Maybe let someone with night vision take over for now. Why don't you go look for a light source? I'll keep messing with this in the meantime. Okay, but... But what? Looks kind of spooky out there. <sighs> You're a big kid. You'll be fine. Okay. Uh, 
Oh. Hey, I can go up the stairs more easily. Uh, the power's out. How would that open? Oh, but I can read that perfectly fine, you know. Don't question. That will leave candles? Yeah, I do. This is the first time I've actually gotten to use them. I'm very happy. Are you concerned about the electricity being out? Not really. The ambiance is way better this way. It makes you want to take a nice long nap. I see. Can I borrow one of your candles, by the way? Sure, take as many as you want. Thanks. I'll just take this one. Sounds good. Gotta go, but I'll see you around. See you, dude. Come back if you want to nap together. I'll think about it. Stop throwing tomato, tomato cat. No. <gasps> Wait. There's seven of these. I gotta find that seventh snow globe. Right there. I have brought the candle. Great. Hopefully you can make heads or tails of this because I'm stumped. Well, I know not to drag them. Screw it, I did it. Whoopsie doodle. Uh huh. Oh. N oh no, it's one of these puzzles. No, I'm not good with these ones. Like, literally. I'm not good with them. Hmm. No. No. Dang it! That one has to go like that. That one has to go like that. Meaning C. Stop it. No. Bad. Bad. Wait a minute. What if I... Did that. Put you there. There's no way to get D. Oh, wait. Wait a second. My brain might be braining finally. No. Hmm. Well, that doesn't work either. Shoot. Dang it, man. Hmm. Yes. Wait for some reason. No, I don't want to see. I don't know why I did that, to be honest. There's only one place to put A. I guess. Because no matter what, it blocks off that. Even if I was to do something like this. Meaning then C has to come either. It's for sure going here. Hmm. Go around the top B with A. <sighs> uh, 
Thank you. Too far. Too far. Stop it. Yeah. You see, I just needed one. I got it now. All I needed was one. Thank you, James. I have... Hey, you actually did it. Wasn't that bad, you just had to connect the knot. Damn, guess you have some engineering chops in you. Well, guess we're back to square one, huh? I think maybe we should stop messing with it for now. I think that's a good call. Not to leave you on a cliffhanger, but I've got a few more ideas yet. Don't be a stranger. Okay, Tori leaves, but there's no need to carry this candle around anymore. Hmm. Well, I do have both. Yo, yo, yo. We got two batteries. Yes! Oh my god, I've been waiting to jam for so long. Wait no longer. Literally can't wait a second more second. Give me those batteries. Sean plugs in the batteries. We're green, baby! We are? You know, like... Like a green light? Just roll with it, man. Words don't have to make any sense. They're in tune. I'm not sure if that's true. Necessarily. Who needs truth when you have groove? Oh my god. Also, please keep your expectation low. I am bad at piano. It's okay. I've, I've been practicing, though. Check this shit out. Wait, wait, j just give me a second. Take your time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Ah, you know what? Forget it. Box is overrated anyways. <laughs> I think this one's Beethoven's. Like the dog? Sean shakes his head. That talented motherfucking pupper. Anyway. Do you know what... How to do a heart and soul? Like the piano duet? Nope. Dude, I'll teach you. It's super easy. Sounds fun. Teach you the top part because it's easier. You watching? Yeah, go ahead. I need sheet for this. Think you got it? <laughs> Whatever, let's do it. All right. Yeah, scoot over. This is not going to go good. No, it's not time to. No. I did. <laughs> <laughs> that was horrible. Yeah, that wasn't bad. It, it was kind of bad. Okay, maybe a little. Still fun to mess around on, though. I did not do good. I know I messed up. I went too far. Like playing a mall piano. Oh, me and my partner used to go to town on a mall piano. We were the fucking menace of Philadelphia, man. Mills. Nice. Partner's the one who taught me the duet, you know? You were like a goddamn prodigy on the keyboard. I'm like, no, by this point, I'm not in the classical, right? Uh huh. Me, I prefer something with a beat. But when Danny ticked the ivories, it was like, wow, fucking transcendental. That's the sort of shit that makes you fall in love with someone. Suddenly, I understood why someone might devote their life to being able to play like that. Not me personally, but you know. Someone. Yeah, I bet. You said you play guitar, though, right? Oh, yeah. But not like how Danny played piano. We used to jam together, you know? Our neighbors would come bang on our door and complain. Good times. 
nice. Dude, I remember one time we were just jamming out. Windows open because it's a nice day, and one of our neighbors pokes his head inside with a tiny dog in his arms looking furious. And he's like, what is that god-awful noise? Oh, hi. Tori peers down the case. Oh, hey, Tori. Blackstar, good to see you again. Sean, how many times do I have to tell you some people are trying to work around here? Work on what? We're literally dead. On important things. Important purgatory things. Preening your feathers is not an important purgatory thing. Just try to keep it down. No offense, but a choir of muse is not exactly angelic. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Sorry. Tori walks back up the stairs. Pfft. What a party pooper. Just pooping on all of our parties and stuff. Right? I'll just turn down the volume a bit next time. Hot sauce! I can't do that! I don't have hot sauce and <laughs> lactose intolerant! Come on! <laughs> I'll write it down. I'm sure I could come up with it sometime. Cinnamon candy juice. I don't even have candy. Uh, I have like nothing on me at the moment. I did not expect someone to do that already. <laughs> uh. Hang on a minute. <laughs> Saw it at the points. You know, fair enough. It's the most fun I had since me and Kyug soon snuck into Oliver's library and built a fort out of his books. I had fun too. See you around, okay? See ya. I. One second. This is actually a good time to end the episode then. <laughs>